James, Viscount Severn is the youngest of Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip's grandchildren. The son of Prince Edward and Sophie, Countess of Wessex, the teenage royal is 14th in line to the throne, falling just ahead of his older sister Lady Louise Windsor. Unlike Prince William and Prince Harry, James leads a life away from the limelight, maintaining a level of privacy as a member of the most famous family in Britain. The young royal made a rare public appearance earlier this year when he joined his sister and cousins to mourn the loss of their grandmother. The eight royal grandchildren stood guard by the Queen's coffin in an emotional vigil. Then, the following week, he joined his family at Westminster Abbey for Her Majesty's state funeral and later travelled to St George's Chapel in Windsor for the committal service. Since then, James has kept a low profile. When the Earl and Countess of Wessex got married in 1999, it was decided that the couple's children would not have princely titles, giving them the opportunity to shape their own existence outside of the royal family. Instead, they received the courtesy titles of the children of an earl. Hence, James is known as Viscount Severn. As the BBC reported in 2016, Edward and Sophie have gone to great lengths to ensure their children enjoy as much of a normal life as possible. Certainly when they were very young we tried to keep them out of it. Only because for their sakes, to grow up as normally as possible we felt was quite important, Sophie said. And they're going to have to go out and get a job and earn a living later on in life, if they've had as normal a start in life they possibly can get, then hopefully that will stand them in good stead. Like Princess Anne, who decided her two children, Peter Phillips and Zara Tyndall, would not have royal titles, the Wessexes wanted their kids to be able to find their own passions and pursue their own interests. This year, Lady Louise enrolled at St. Andrews University to complete a degree in English literature. Neither Louise nor James are expected to carry out royal duties and according to their mother, the pair are unlikely to ever have to take on official roles within the firm. In a 2020 interview with Christine Lamb for the Sunday Times, Sophie explained, we try to bring them up with the understanding they are very likely to have to work for a living. Hence we made the decision not to use HRH titles. They have them and can decide to use them from 18, but I think it's highly unlikely. It was recently revealed Lady Louise had been earning £6.83 an hour working at a garden centre during the summer months after completing her A-levels. They go to a regular school, they both attend top independent schools. They go to friends for sleepovers and parties, the Countess continued. At weekends we do lots of dog walking and stay with friends. I guess not everyone's grandparents live in a castle, but where you are going is not the important part, or who they are. According to royal author Katie Nichol, the Wessex's parenting style is revered by other royals. Kate is said to admire the way Prince Edward and his wife, Sophie, are raising their children, Lady Louise Windsor and James, Viscount Severn, in the bosom of the royal family but prepared for life in the real world, she wrote in Vanity Fair in September. The Wessexes were known to be particularly close with the late monarch and Prince Philip. The family of four live at Bagshow, 